Hey everyone, Dave here, and welcome to Blackforge Overview. I think this one was quite a while in the development. Well, I mean the awards date back to 2020, so it's been some time. <laughs> I suppose I could have some connection to this project either mentally or physically. I'm a big fan of medieval times. Sometimes I feel like I should have been born in that period. And then in my college days, I was training martial arts of that kind. So I definitely could have a potential to become a blacksmith and at least I won't bore myself. <laughs> So Blackforge is an adventure smithing simulator game where by honing your craft and completing the request of the townspeople you'll become a legendary blacksmith that is capable of crafting a variety of weaponry and tools to use in a forge that's imbued with mystical forces. As far as simulator games go, we did not have a single one of that kind, well at least purely dedicated to just crafting stuff because there were certain games like a township tale and recently medieval dynasty settlement i forgot already that had some parts of it but just not going full on 100 percent into the set concept it's clearly gonna be a mechanical game all across the board i wish though that the graphical department could follow up because a lot of things are looking a little bit bland even though we're set in a small environment it's mostly because i presume it's a physics game so that's where most resources go towards still through punky lenses magic i don't think it's gonna look as good as the current standard on our platform is nowadays i do appreciate that there's gonna be a campaign going on so it won't be purely a sandbox experience that usually leads me to being clueless in the gameplay having goals in mind i think this is the right way to go is it something that's potentially gonna be a play from the channel i don't think so there won't be enough action to keep me interested but we'll have to see things could change and i might be just crafting some weaponry here <laughs> let's go enter the forge oh boy it's even worse that i saw in the trailer and there's like a movement simulation but it comes across as a seizure <laughs> but yeah plant textures low resolution as well which is just not good <laughs> well thanks for the teleport is this what quest 3 is capable of i don't think so like it needs a heavy visual overhaul cause I don't even think the mechanics will support it. Greetings. Let me introduce myself. I am simply known as the merchant. I travel this land collecting various materials and trinkets. I heard a rumor that a descendant of the legendary weaponsmith was going to fire up the old smithy again. That must be you then. This place has been abandoned for a long time. In my early adventuring days, I used to come here for good quality weapons. You have quite big shoes to fill. I can help you get started, as well as spread the word that this place has opened up once again. The timing is indeed intriguing, especially with all the unusual things that are happening. Here. Take this matchstick and fire up the force. Ah, oh, it's been such a long time since I last saw it. It's like when I'm turning, there's also performance issues. Heavy for the rendering. It's not looking good. Pine 
not handle. See that log sticking out? Pull it out to your desired length. These lands have a lot of different kinds of trees. Looks like you will be able to collect all kinds of goods in that shed. <laughs> well, I guess it is a magical forge after all. Now, where is that axe? Oh, <laughs> it's right there on the roof. How in the world did it end up there? <laughs> you can use your tongs for some extra reach. They're right there on your hip. Go ahead and chop off a piece. That seems like a gardening tool. But also if you were talking about physics game, you should be able to grab the outdoor handle and then physically do it. So pressing buttons in a simulator game. to the spirit. It's not like perfectly accurate, see? Pieces are exactly the same. something made. You see, my trusty wagon is in dire need of a new handle. I wrote a request and put it on that board. Don't worry, I will guide you through the process. It's like a lazy tool if I don't want to bend down. <laughs> Bring the request over to your planning table. If I recall, there should be an area designated for requests. I have some height measurements. If it's for me or for the tool. <laughs> this is now your active mission request. The details of the mission should be visible right there on the table. Hmm? Oh, what's that? Ah, oh, my chisel. That's where it went. <laughs> I've been looking for that. Well, you can keep it. It will be useful in just a bit. You can leave it on the table for now. If you go out and chop some wood, I'll teach you how to make it into a proper hand. Remember that you can pull out as much wood as you need. The rendering is atrocious. Do I have like an ingredient list? Chop off a big piece. So this is the smallest it can. Bring it to the lead station. Okay. Lathe. I don't have like an additional holster. Oh my god, it's like fighting with me. chisel that you just got and turn the wood down to a decent size enough to have a comfortable grip like there's not much feedback going on which is when weird satisfied, go ahead 
and place your creation inside the portal that opened up. This magic portal is an easy way for me to haul many big items at once. Wait, what do I mean to doing? A new handle. <laughs> you didn't say about the thickness. I'm making a hot dog. Well, what's up with those subtitles? Yeah, there's like no physics going on, which is weird. There are also clearly stages, like... It's not super precise. You need that? Uh, grab the request and place it in that mailbox. I'll empty it before I leave. First thing to know what's a handle. Good job. <laughs> I evaluated the request you gave me and it looks perfect. Grab it from the board to complete it. I have a good feeling about you. I sense that you will do much good as a blacksmith. Mm -hmm. Also, so I don't forget, here is a map. It will show you information about the world around you and also indicate where I am. Ain't magic great? You can hang it on the wall above your planning station. If that's all you need from me, I'll be on my way. Ring this bell here and I'll head out. I'm getting annoyed. Oh, yes. One last thing. There are more people who could use your help. I have some more requests for you. I'll leave them on the board. Get going on those requests and I'll be right back. Good luck. I just hate the interactions and... This, like, ain't it, but... Let's just... Continue and see what's gonna happen. At least there's a pet, which... Seems to be the only thing going on. <laughs> An original club. Is there like maybe a hanger for this? Like even this would make more sense.
this might be for the chisel. Which I have no idea when I dropped. Cheap, cheap. Are you back already? Out here. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I have work to do. So a clap is just a thick stick. Or a hot dog. Request. I talked to this adventurer who broke his staff by accident. He needs it repaired. I put the request on the board. I don't care. Like, I wish it would just be precise enough to do oval shapes I guess you have a barbecue steak It doesn't even fit here What? I placed the broken staff inside the request portal. Bring the request to the planning station to retrieve it. Hmm? As you can see on the icons on the bottom of the request, this person wants the staff to be above medium length. And first, you need to separate the pieces. Go ahead and grab your hammer and you don't have a hammer. Oh, it has to be in there somewhere. It's all the way up there. Oh. Remember that you can use your tongues to expand your reach. So, here's the tricky part. I'm not sure how your ancestors used to separate pieces. But I'm sure there are some clues around here somewhere. Try hitting that nail with your hammer. I think they have something to do with your ancestors' memories. Maybe they can guide you. It looks like they use the anvil to separate pieces. Place the creation on the anvil and hit that glowing rune over there. That doesn't make much sense. Align the pieces and attach them back together, and it will be fixed. That other nail might help you to figure out how. Ah, so holding the hammer above your head until thunder strikes and then hitting your creation should do the trick. Huh? It's so like specific and unusual so, the adventurer asked for the staff to be above medium length i believe there are some markings on the side of the building over there you can use those to see if it's long enough you can also weigh your creations on that measuring scale some adventurers prefer either lighter or heavier weapons. Place a stone on the other side of the scale to compare it to the weapon's weight. As you can see, the weapon is fairly light. 
As long as it's close to the weight of the matching stone, it should be fine. When you're done, place the staff in the portal. Put the request in the mailbox and I'll bring it back to him as soon as possible. I've also received some more requests for you. <laughs> You're building up quite the reputation around here. Keep it up. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'll head out and see how things are going around the copper mines. I've heard they might need some help. The time's over and I'm over it. <laughs> this is like nothing as it should be from a simulator perspective. There are no physics, so there is no excuse for the lack of graphics, interactions, like everything is just bad here. I suppose that's why it was for the longest time on side quest or uplap. Doesn't matter. This is not official store ready. If it is, then it's just not complete with the level of anything. We're talking occlusion, tools, placements, either holsters or, I don't know, some designated places because once I lose it, I can't find it. It doesn't return to its original place. Just now, like, it's just annoying at this point. Because the level of design is quest 1 days, not quest 3 at all. The only thing is good that you can pet the fire reindeer, I suppose. But other than that, it's like rank. The animations aren't good either. And it's just not it at all. 